If a Muslim fast with an intention of reducing his or her weight uh, or dieting, will he get the reward of fasting, he or she? If you're talking about reward in general, Islamic, they're talking about Jannah, forgiveness, etc. Our beloved Prophet said in Sunan Tirmidhi, Book of Fasting, Hadith number 2331, that there's no fast for a person who does not intend to fast the night before. Intention is a must. Intention means for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, for the pleasure of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. A person who doesn't have this intention, surely he will not get the religious benefits. He will not get the spiritual benefits. The reason why we fast, that is taqwa, what we discussed in the last episode. As far as the other medical benefits the person does for dieting or if he does for weight loss, he may get those benefits. Like there are people who fast maybe for political reason, people do hunger strike, people, they fast for a pressure. Some people fast, as we mentioned, for weight loss, for dieting. So that part of the medical benefit they may get, but not the benefit completely of Islam. And as Allah says in the Quran, in Surah Hud, chapter number 11, verse number 15 and 16. Anyone who does any deeds for this world, Allah will show, give him the reward without diminishing for this world. But he will have no reward in the hereafter, except for hellfire. And he's really, the person who does such deed is really misguided. So fasting only for weight loss, dieting is just, it is penny-wise pound foolish. What I've realized that we have to mainly fast for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Then we get the overall benefit.